Sarast Sarast is a venomous viper species native to the deserts of northern Africa and parts of the Middle East. It often is easily recognized by the presence of a pair of supraocular horns, although hornless individuals do occur. No subspecies are currently recognized. Description The average total length, body plus tail, is 30 to 60 centimeters. 12 to 24 in, with a maximum total length of 85 cm, 33 in. Females are larger than males. One of the most distinctive characteristics of this species is the presence of supraorbital horns, one over each eye. However, these may be reduced in size or absent, see genus Cereasts. The eyes are prominent and set on the sides of the head. There is significant sexual dimorphism, with males having larger heads and larger eyes than females. Compared to C. Gasparitae, the relative head size of C. Sarasts is larger and there is a greater frequency of horned individuals, 13% versus 48%, respectively. The color pattern consists of a yellowish, pale gray, pinkish, reddish or pale brown ground color that almost always matches the substrate color where the animal is found. Dorsally, a series of dark, semi-rectangular blotches runs the length of the body. These blotches may or may not be fused into crossbars. The belly is white. The tail, which may have a black tip, is usually thin. Common names of this species include Desert Sidewinding Horn Viper Saharan Horn Viper, Horn Desert Viper, Sahara Horn Viper, Desert Horn Viper, North African Horn Viper, African Desert Horn Viper, Greater Sarasts, Asp and Horn Viper. In Egypt it is called El Torisha. Geographic Range It is found in arid North Africa, Morocco. Mauritania and Mali, eastward through Algeria, Tunisia, Niger, Libya and Chad to Egypt, Sudan, Ethiopia and Somalia, through Sinai to the northern Negev of Israel. In the Arabian Peninsula, it occurs in Yemen, Kuwait, extreme southwestern Saudi Arabia and parts of the country in Qatar where it is sympatric with C. Gasparate. A report of this species being found in Lebanon is unlikely, according to Joger, 1984. Originally, the type locality was listed only as Orienti. However, Flower, 1933, proposed Egypt by way of clarification. Habitat These snakes favor dry, sandy areas with sparse rock outcroppings and tend not to prefer coarse sand. Occasionally, they are found around oases, and up to an altitude of 1,500 meters 4, feet. Cooler temperatures, with annual averages of 20 degrees Celsius or less, are preferred. Behavior They typically move about by side winding, during which they press their weight into the sand or soil leaving whole body impressions. Often, it is even possible to use these impressions to make vendoral scale counts. They have a reasonably placid temperament, but if threatened, they may assume a C-shaped posture and rapidly rub their coils together. Because they have strongly keeled scales, this rubbing produces a rasping noise, similar to the sound produced by snakes of the genus Echis. In the wild they are typically ambush predators, lying submerged in sand adjacent to rocks or under vegetation. When approached, they strike very rapidly, holding on to the captured prey, small birds and rodents, until the venom takes effect. Reproduction, in captivity, mating was observed in April and always occurred while the animals were buried in the sand. This species is oviparous laying 8 to 23 eggs that hatch after 50 to 80 days of incubation. The eggs are laid under rocks and in abandoned rodent burrows. The hatchlings measure 12 to 15 centimeters, 
about 5-6 inches, in total length. Phenom, C. Saras Phenom is not very toxic, although it is reported to be similar in action to Ikis Phenom. Envenomation usually causes swelling, hemorrhage, necrosis, nausea, vomiting, and hematuria. A high phosphopase A2 content may cause cardiotoxicity and mitoxicity. Studies of venom from both C. Saras and C. Vipro list a total of eight venom fractions, the most powerful of which has hemorrhagic activity. Venom yields vary, with ranges of 19 to 27 mg to 100 mg of dried venom being reported. For venom toxicity, Brown, 1973, gives LD50 values of 0.4 mg slash KG4 and 3.0 mg slash KGFC. An estimated lethal dose for humans is 40 to 50 mg.